Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and this is to talk a little bit about uh, a few little things that are updates for Windows 10. One of course is um, the continuation of the Patch Tuesday week. So of course this week we had security updates, a pretty big security update too. If you haven't applied them, uh, please do so because there's quite a few um, critical flaws, including some zero days that are probably already exploited by hackers. So that's why you need to apply them. Once again, available for Windows 8.1, Windows 10 supported versions, uh, and even the beta channel insider version of 20H2 for the fall. So that is rolling out pretty well. Background noise has not been very high. I think they've been careful, but We'll continue looking into the situation in case anything changes. Considering that it's a really big update and that it takes a little longer than usual, it seems to be rolling out quite well in general. So for those that wonder, and of course, the question that I often get is, should I apply this? Should I apply this? You know, security updates, I think these should be applied. It's very important. As for the rest, um, you know, anything that's bug fixes and so on, or even feature updates, you can wait, you know, don't don't rush it and it'll, it'll be there when it's going to be there and that's pretty much it. Also, some of you have been asking me, uh, well, you know, you are testing out 20H2 and, and checking it out, so it must be ready and they've released it already. No, this comes from, and I'll repeat it, the Insider Channel. The updates uh, for 20H2 are in the Beta Channel. This is in insider build so it's not released yet it won't be released before september maybe october and um, and it could be november you know it's this fall sometime this fall um so no it's not ready yet we are right now still rolling out version 2004 i still get a lot of people saying well you know is this uh ready is this um you know it seems to have a lot of bugs from what i see uh you know, the majority of blockers and and the majority of bugs that were there at the release in May are pretty much gone. There's some blockers, a few people are wondering why their Surface, Microsoft Surface, don't have the update. Uh, in that case, the updates are not there because they haven't updated the drivers yet. They want to update the uh, Microsoft Surface device drivers before they unblock. So they're tweaking the dri the drivers. At some point when the new drivers are released, that's when the block is going to be removed, apparently, to Microsoft Surface devices. As for the rest, it should be rolling out to more and more devices. Uh, Microsoft is actually looking into the situation with its AI, the artificial intelligence that they're using to kind of look at what's happening. And that AI seems to be uh, opening the valves of Windows 10 May 2020 update to more and more machines. I will uh, once again state it, this is not a update that is forced on you unless you are at a version of Windows that is soon to expire. So it's the case for version 1809. Actually, 1809 got six months of life more than expected because of COVID. So it is going to expire in November. And that means that you are starting, people on 1809 are starting to see uh, May 2020 update being pushed to them without them having anything to do. Uh, that's because they want you to be on the new version of Windows to make sure that you aren't going to expire. 1903 is not yet, 1909 is not yet being pushed also. You could see it if you go into Windows Update, it might show up there. But it's not going to install unless you click the download and install button. The rollout uh, seems to be going well. Last time that we had numbers, 11, roughly 11.6% 11 of people were now on the version uh, 2004 or the May 2020 update. So it's one out of 10. That means there's still a lot of people, you know, I don't think it's more than 12 or 13% as of this video. It's rolling out uh, a little slow, but um, you know, it means also that um, the majority of you out there don't see it yet and not to worry about it. I see a lot of people worry when they don't see that they get that new update. 
and they wonder why and they wonder if they're going to get it and if it's something that's wrong with their computer. Uh, that's not the way to think about it. Remember that when it's ready, when it has everything okay according to their AI, that the rollout's going to be fine for your PC, that's when it does move ahead. So for a big majority of you out there, it's simply not available yet. It's going to show up at some point. Once again, don't rush it. It's going to be there when it's going to be there. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.